all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, welcome, I'm Deidre. If you're returning, it's great to see you. So this is my Body Slims Round 3 Week 1 update and my health and more in 2024 video for the week. So I am thrilled. I had a 7.8 pound loss for Body Slims Round 3 Week 1. I weighed myself this morning because I've been weighing myself every day for 30 days. Um, so I've actually gone over it a few days, but I also missed a couple of days, so I'm not worried about it. I was actually down almost another two pounds this morning. That brings my total to 9.4 pounds this round and a new low for my Body Slims program. So I'm very excited about that. Yay. Um, I have had the stomach, like a stomach bug of some sort that's just kind of wreaked havoc but here we are. Um, I did want to share some things I've been doing this week. So um, I purchased these overnight oats. So I ordered 16 of them in different flavors. This one has 280 calories. Um, and I just mix it. Right now I'm just using this blender cup because the theirs that they sent me is dirty. Uh, it's clean now, but it wasn't clean last night when I needed it. Um, and then I did eight ounces of almond milk, unsweetened almond milk. So eight ounces of that almond milk was 60 calories. Um, so this would be a uh, 340 calorie breakfast for me. Um, I have also this round of Body Slims, I have given up coffee only during the week. And the reason for that is because of the extremely high amount of creamer. I like to put in my coffee. Like it, it's ridiculous. It's probably 150 calories, maybe pushing 200 some days. And that's even switching to a lower calorie creamer. Yeah, I still do it. So there's that. I wasn't sure how I was gonna like these cold. It actually doesn't bother me too bad. Um, I also have some electrolytes right here and water so i am well hydrated in lieu of coffee i have been drinking black tea so this morning i did a twinings irish black tea and a lemon tea like i just mix them because they're such big cups and then that way i kind of get like some flavor some extra flavor to the black tea without adding cream because I didn't add like I don't add cream or sugar or anything I just drink it straight that's the thing about tea I don't have to put anything in it so that's great um we just got back from our trip to Galveston it was a lot of fun Galveston is a very expensive city I had no idea so that was a very pricey trip for some like we only picked like one main activity to do which was Pleasure Pier and that cost us over a hundred dollars for like an hour and a half or two hours. Like we weren't even there that long. It was a lot. Um, I don't think we would do it again. Um, we were also surprised at how dirty the city was. Like nothing, there was so many cigarette butts and broken glass and trash everywhere. Um, so that was a little bit of a turn off. Uh, we thought it would be more walkable. Like when my husband and I stayed in Corpus, we were able to walk to dinner. There was so much stuff around us. The beach was across the street and the beach was across the street for us this time too. But the walkability isn't there because some streets don't have sidewalks and then there's a lot of homeless people, which is fine. Um, they were very nice. We said hi to all of them. Um, the amount of broken glass, bottle caps, just trash everywhere, people driving crazy. It was, it was a lot. We walked to dinner the first night and it ended up being a three mile walk round trip. And with a four year old, that was a long, a long walk for him. So he was real fussy. So that was a whole thing. Um, we did spend some time at the beach. I didn't go in the water, but I did um, hang out. Well, I did go in the water a little bit. It's because I didn't want to leave our stuff and then like wander off into the water because my husband and son were in the water the whole time. Um, so I'll enter just a couple clips and like maybe some pictures right here for you guys to check out and enjoy.
Hope you guys enjoyed those um but yeah it was fun i did get my walks in um to the best of my ability i ended up picking up a stomach bug on the way home like i started not feeling good by tuesday i or monday night really i was like out i went to the doctor tuesday they gave me some nausea medication but i was there for two hours I barely made it to my car because like I started breaking out into a cold sweat and like feeling like I was about to just like lose it and thankfully I did not but I had to like sit in the car and like deep breathe and have the air conditioner blowing on me um I started feeling better yesterday we wrapped up Hunter's bereavement classes or like program that he was in um so we did that yesterday and I've been back at work since yesterday so yeah but I'm so excited that this round is going really well. Um, like I said, really the only changes I've made this round is giving up the coffee during the week and the coffee creamer switching to the Irish or English breakfast black teas. Um, and I have, I don't, I haven't done those overnight oats more than just a couple of times because I just got them. Um, so this will be like the first morning. Like I had some yesterday, but it was like leftover from the day before because I literally like I could not eat. Um, yesterday I did eat like full meals and my stomach was a little upset yesterday. So I think today I'm going to try. I know oatmeal is probably not the best to eat on an upset stomach. I don't know if it is or not. Um, but I think for lunch I'm going to try and keep it easier on my tongue. Like maybe a little bland. Uh, maybe some rice and something. I don't know. I got to figure something out because... I think my tummy is revolting from yesterday's food because it's like, whoa, girl, you jumped in way too fast. So there's that. Um, yeah, I didn't take my measurements yet. I haven't done my, I normally do my before pictures and like we do what's like our walk. So my cheeks are all flushed this morning. Um, it's where you set up your camera and you walk towards your camera and back again. And I usually do it twice and then each like I do it at the beginning, middle and end of each round. I don't even, I didn't even do any of my ending pictures and last video of the last round because I was done. I was so fed up round two. Um, so I need to do those because I'm already a weekend. I haven't done them yet. You know, it's like I'm trying to have the bandwidth to do what I need to do. But like some of the things I need to do kind of fall by the wayside. Like my house is in utter chaos again. I don't understand how there's three people living here and it's in constant chaos all the time. I mean, we do have four pets, but still. So I start cat sitting again today. I have a client until Monday. Then I have a new one from Tuesday on. Then I have another returning client. And then I have another new client after that. So I've got the next few weeks of cat sitting like book solid. Um, so I'm getting into a little bit of a busy time for that, which is fine. Um, but yeah. I just wanted to check in. I hope you guys are having a great day. I hope that you'll like and subscribe to my channel down below and I'll see y'all later. Don't forget to check out the ladies down below. I'm gonna link all of their channels below. So make sure you check out their Health & More 24 videos and any of their other videos. And we do have a new lovely lady joining us, Jessie. So go check out her channel too. We'll talk to y'all later, bye.